Meghan Markle stepped out for a charming appearance on Tuesday morning, visiting the Royal Variety Charities Nursing and Care Home in Twickenham to do arts and crafts, and a little bit of caroling. The Duchess of Sussex looked stunning in a tight floral midi dress by Brock Collection for the visit to Brinsworth House in London. Meghan, who is due to give birth in spring 2019 wore a long grey soya and kyo coat as she stepped out for the engagement. Meghan joined residents as they made festive decorations and were entertained with Christmas songs. The Duchess said she was feeling very pregnant, as she chatted with retired artists and entertainers at the home. The Royal Variety Charity supports those who have worked in the entertainment industry and are in need of help and assistance due to old age, ill health or hard times. The pregnant Duchess is a former actress who, with her husband Harry, attended the Royal Variety performance in November when acts on the bill included the West End cast of the hit musical Hamilton, chart topper George Ezra and singer Andrea Bocelli and his son Matteo. Brinsworth House is decorated to emphasize its theatrical lineage, representing the retired artists and entertainers who have been supported there over the years. Among other famous entertainers who have been cared for at the residential home are Sir Norman Wisdom, Dame Thora Hurd and EastEnders actor Leslie Grantham. Giles Cooper, the charity's chairman, said. The timing of the visit is fantastic as it comes a few weeks after the Royal Variety performance which she attended with Prince Harry. Meghan's visit comes after her father Thomas Markle gave a heartbreaking interview on Good Morning Britain claiming he had been shunned by the Duchess. The 74-year-old said he has not spoken to Meghan for months, following the royal wedding fallout. Mr. Markle was due to walk his daughter down the aisle at her Windsor wedding, but he pulled out at the last minute due to health reasons. It also emerged shortly before Meghan and Harry's big day that Mr. Markle had staged paparazzi pictures in a bid to improve his media image. But the retired award-winning lighting director pleaded with Meghan to get back in touch. Speaking from San Diego, Mr. Markle told ITV viewers. I'm hopeful that soon something will be resolved and we'll be talking. This can't continue forever. I love my daughter very much and she has to know that. I would really appreciate if she would just call me, reach out to me somehow, send me a text, just say you're there and you're hearing me. And the retired award-winning lighting director appealed to the Queen to help heal the rift with his daughter. Mr. Markle said. I would appreciate anything she could do. I would think she would want to resolve family problems. All families, royal or otherwise, are the same and they should all be together, certainly around the holidays.